vehicles. Now there's the performance aspect to them, and there's also the appearance aspect to them. Now, you know, I, I like bikes, and when, when it comes to bikes, you know, I'm more of a performance type of person. Hence my Gearsicle project, and I hope to b build a recumbent some. But I also feel that appearance is a part of bicycles to be taken into consideration, you know. We all like to have our own styles and the style and appearance of our bikes or cars, it, it makes a statement about us. And we kind of take pride in that. Uh, this is an older type of bike that I, I have that was actually once my uncle's bike and I inherited it from him since he died. And so I decided that since it's all kind of junky and, and stuff and I probably should get a new bike soon, I decided I'd play around with it a little bit and create this spiral type of effect going around the bike. Now, to create this kind of effect, I, I used eight colors and have one of each color in each of these dual set of spokes because if you look around here there's this these eight set of spokes on this bike. Well, with your your bike it, it may vary. What you want to do is take one color, let's say let's start off with yellow here. And then since there's eight spokes we're gonna have eight of them. So you could do 360 degrees divided by 8, 45 degrees, but you don't have to do that since the area to which you'd, you'd put the, them is already established for you by the spokes. But the other measurement that you would have to do is take the radius of the wheel from the center to the outer area where the spokes touch the rim, divide that by Eight, and then with each spoke going around you would want to put that same color out that much difference that much distance so you would take it or go out that much distance and from here go that much that much and then you just do that for all the, the colors and you'll create this spiral type of effect now let's see it in action There it is. Some nice spiraling effect. Turn them into LEDs and, and then they, they light up when they pass by a sensor. I think we're in competition with this bike.